What's going on y'all? We're back out here on the Texas coast doing a little bit of an evening afternoon trip and uh, got a couple of hours. I really want to try to target some trout. There's some good spots out here fishing some reefs out in the middle of the bay. So I'm gonna get out here, see if I can locate some trout. Y'all stay tuned. See if we can't catch one of these doggone Texas biggins. All right, y'all, we just pulled up to our first reef. We're gonna start off by throwing the HK Custom Tackle Fluke. I'm gonna throw it on a pearl white color. I feel like with the color of the water just a little bit stained up, that pearl white's gonna do just right. We got some jumping bait right there. Right in front of us. Oh, he's on. Fish on. Little guy. All right. <laughs> That is a start. Speckled trout number one. Oh, easy release. Man, he even hit it like a little guy. Y'all, I think we're on a school of fish here. Come in here and I saw bait flicking up and I just saw a trout flash in front of me underneath the surface. Do believe this reef might be holding them. He's on fish number two. Looks like we got us another dink. Whoo! Let me get that hook out of you, buddy. See you, dude. See if we can't do a little spot lock action right there. If it doesn't attempt to, he's on. That's a little bit of a better fish, y'all. That's a good one. Be a trout. Be a doggone. There's no way. If that's a trout, it's a hoss, y'all. Ooh, I have no reason to believe it'd be a redfish though. I'm sitting here amongst trout. Be a trout. Be a trout. Come on. Come on. Come on up. Still can't tell what it is. That's a redfish. Oh man, you fooled me, dude. You fooled me, man. Catching them dink trout right there, you know. I know there's some good trout in there. Man, look at that redfish. Y'all check that guy out right there. Got him on a fluke. He definitely fooled me very very light colored red which is what you would expect out here in the bay when you get tighter in the marsh systems you're fishing a lot of mud a lot of crab stuff like that that's where you get your real copper color redfish blue tail stuff like that and when you get out here on the sand flats open up you get out here around this oyster and sand it uh they lighten up a little bit but Go ahead and put this guy back in the water. Get in here, try to find some trout. Maybe even some more redfish. But yeah, awesome catch, y'all. Y'all, this is actually the second reef that we've hit. We stopped at a reef before this, fished it a little bit, and I mean, it was pretty dry. Nothing going on there. So decided to head closer on in to where we launched from and hit some of the closer reefs. And then soon after, just caught this trout pretty much on back-to-back -back cast then threw back in there and picked up that red so I got a feeling there's a lot of fish hanging out right here he's on oh that's another decent fish that one does feel like a trout not gonna be a giant at least it don't feel like one right now be a trout another red fish 
another redfish y'all that's all right though these are definitely still fun to catch I mean we are freaking on them y'all on them little guy but he's still a legal redfish see you dude everything so far has been on the hk custom tackle fluke and a pearl white i mean this lure just works really really well for catching just about anything and it really shines in open water like this it's not a lure that i like throwing you know deep up in a marsh system or anything like that but if i can get out on a flat in open water and just jig it around bounce it he's on ah oh, he's off golly let me stop talking and get in here and catch a fish all right y'all i hate to say it but i think we got to make a move at least off of this hole right here maybe ease on down here fish a little bit more of this reef uh, we caught two reds two trout two dink trout and uh, the bites kind of kind of died off a little bit so we'll fan out move on down the reef hopefully find some more come on that's a decent filling fish said that that was not a decent fish oh another trout though man just the way it was pulling it felt kind of heavy dude, you tricked me dude i didn't even know i had a fish on till you got close to the boat my line kept on moving see ya there he is there he is Another doggone dinker! Come on, man. Y'all gotta get bigger. I am in a mess. The juveniles. But, <laughs> I don't wanna leave. I don't know, just, you get that, that feeling that there's more out there. Then again, I could just be falling into that trap. There's a fish. That feels like a trout too. Yep, head shaking like a trout. Please be a trout. That's got head shakes like a trout. That's a good fish. That is a good fish. Come on. redfish <laughs> oh my goodness you know just one of them things when you're trout fishing everything's a trout until it's not all right another beautiful redfish another legal redfish probably sitting right around 19 inches or so see you dude Man, oh man, this body of water is absolutely loaded with fish. This be a good place to take a charter or something. There is no shortage of fish right here. I'm just starting to lose faith that there's a big trout sitting amongst these other fish. Might need to make a move. Give it about five more minutes and I'll make a move. He's on. There we go. Oh, another little trout. We moved inshore right here, got out of the bay a little bit, and uh, targeting a couple of flats in between uh, some bayous and marshes. 
See if we can't catch some trout doing that. Got this guy, but it's still another little one. Jesus. Y'all see that? All right, bird, if you want to hit your ride, come on. We about to go. <laughs> see ya. That's a fish. There we go. I knew there was going to be fish. Right there on the back side where that current's pushing across that point. Another little one though. We're going to find them y'all. We're going to find a bigger one. We're going to find a bigger trout. Tide's coming in real good right now. Conditions should be getting just about right. He's on. Another trout. I actually think that might have been one of the biggest trouts of the day. Y'all, I'm gonna have to swap my reels out. My bearing went out. My spool bearing went out on this one. I'll try to get it to get us through this trip because I really love this rod that it's sitting on. Everything's set up. All right, y'all, we're gonna go ahead and wrap it up there. Sun's getting ready to go down now. I'm gonna go ahead and trek back to the truck. We caught some fish this evening, y'all. I mean, it was, I mean, everywhere we went, we were hooking into trout and redfish. Now the trout that we caught were super small. There probably aren't any more dink trout left in Texas because we caught them all. I mean, just insane, so. I hope y'all enjoyed the video as much as I enjoyed being out here. If y'all did, hit that like button, share the video, comment with any questions, subscribe if you haven't already. We'll see y'all next time.